Hello, good evening. How are you this week? Okay. Good. Good. Uh, well, tonight, we're back to it, right? Welcome. Welcome to Commands and Colors Ancients. Scenario 11, Scott Bakula. I remember that guy. He was in Quantum Leap. Yeah, and Captain Jonathan Archer on Enterprise. Um, so, yes, tonight, the Battle of Bakula in 208 BC was we are we're nearing the end not only of the the initial scenarios that were packaged with commands and colors ancients and then we'll move on to the first expansion but uh, this is we're drawing to the close of the second Punic War between Carthage and Rome uh, we stay this week last week we were in southern Spain this week we're still in southern Spain and uh, Scipio Africanus is still our star here uh, for the Romans, and he's brought along a couple of other generals with him. Uh, he's got uh, Gaius Lelius and uh, Cassius, and uh, a whole mess of light troops there to uh, round out their center. And then they've got on the wings the standard Roman legions, and they are facing off against Hasdrubal. And the uh, the story so far is that. Um, after the, the, the battle last week, which was uh, a year or so prior to this one, um, Hasdrubal sort of fought them off. Uh, Scipio, I think, attacked New Carthage there in Spain, and what they were attempting to do was to, to knock out all of the generals at once and uh, at the very least separate them, and that's what they've done here is they're, they're trying to break them into, into pieces and uh, knock out each general one at a time. And Hasdrubal is sort of the first one that they're going after here, and they've caught him coming out of winter camp uh, in uh, Bekula, which is which is on that same river as uh, Castulo last year, which is the old uh, Beatus River or Guadalquivir now. So it's very very close to geographically where we were last week, and uh, we have something new tonight. We have not only the hills in the middle, which we're used to the hills. Um, we've got all the Carthaginian light troops occupying those hills. And uh, that was sort of the first line of defense. And then uh, higher up behind those hills, we have the the main body, the fortified camps of Hasdrubal, where he's got his heavy troops encamped, as you see. Tonight, the challenge then is for the Romans to figure out how to conquer um, those camps. And they get a fly, well, I'm going to open up the scenario information here. The War Council, the special rules for this, um, the Carthaginians will get four cards, so they're essentially on the defense for this. The Romans will get six, uh, and they will move first. It's the first one to six banners tonight. And uh, the special rules on this one are those Roman, or the uh, Carthaginian uh, camps, the fortified camps, and I'm bringing up the terrain information on those as well. Uh, just to review the way they work, any foot unit that is inside the fortified camp can ignore uh, one flag and one sword hit while they are attacked within that camp. And that is really yep. the, the only defensive benefit of being in there. Um, the trade-off of which is unfortunately fighting out of a camp, so those heavies instead of battling out with five dice will be reduced by one die. So they will yep. battle out at four. And uh, a unit can ignore one flag when being targeted from a ranged attack. That is right. It, it, you notice it does say any any battle. So that is uh, that is can, that is close combat and ranged combat. So that is a very good point. Uh, and on this one, the Romans are trying to essentially capture those camps. So for any uh, foot unit that they put on there, then they uh, all they have to do is enter it. It doesn't cost anything to enter it. Once they enter it, they get a victory banner immediately. Um, and so on those, we'll, we'll pull out the, the specialty banner blocks. Just to I was going to say, we might need some, some banner pieces yeah, for that. Yeah, we'll finally get to use those <laughs> as they're intended. Using the units as, as banners. <laughs> exactly. Um, so, yes, but you can only get that once per, so at the very uh, most, you're going to get, what, uh, three, three banner points for that. As the Romans. So, uh, just to review the uh, the hills, uh, the hills. Uh, any unit that's on top of the hill battles down uh, at a max of three dice, um, 
and mounted units battle down with two dice, and then any unit attacking uphill is capped at two dice as well. So, uh, But otherwise, they do not affect movement. You can go right over them, but uh, they are the neat high ground, and of course they block line of sight for any ranged combat. And I think that is all for the specialty stuff tonight. Um, it's it's interesting to see that we're we're just we're getting overwhelmed now with light units, <laughs> so it is it is it's, sort it, of we, we've wasted and squandered all the, <laughs> right, the good units. Right, we've killed we've killed all the scripting. yes we've killed all the men of of good stock uh, coming from Spain and Rome, and now we're left with the uh, the children really, and we're gonna put a sword in their hand and tell them not to run away. But um, this. Going back to that article that you and I read this week, uh, I think this is a good opportunity to to try those swarming tactics with the lights, and we'll see how well that plays out. Should be good. Uh, hopefully, last the last couple sessions have not been too favorable for moi, but uh, I'll see if I can catch up some flags tonight. Just a lot of bad luck. That's eh, all. Yeah, that's okay. You'll, you'll 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 catch up. This too might pass. <laughs> But you're first, so why don't you draw up your six cards, and I will draw up my four, and we will get underway. All right. And four for me. Okay. And off we go. units in the center. Those three units. And we will attempt to attack uphill. Alright, they will stand and fight. It's unusual to hear myself say that with lights, but this week, it's uh, going to be the norm, I think. Yep, so uh, max of two dice, which is fine, because we're going to roll two dice. Right. So, oh, no great losses here. So two dice with leader support. Two banners. Oh, let's see, this is how it's going to begin. Well, I can ignore one, because I've got support, but I cannot ignore the other one. Uh, thus, they will fall back two. And they will go to... I would say you were heading for the hills, but you're already there. <laughs> exactly. All right. Second unit, also if we are support. Okay. Attacking up hill. One hit and one retreat. Interesting. Now, the cascading effect there. Take a hit and fall back to there. That's all I've got. And the turn. Car. We'll start with the line command here. Good thing I broke that line up. <laughs> That's right. And uh, we'll see if we can get back on those hills. Just do that. Alright. Let's start here. Paddling down with two dice. And you're supported. Okay. Two back. Leader supported attack. Okay. Next two can please. All right. And try that one. Two dice. And I'll, uh, I'll ignore that. Pour it on two sides, right? Right. And uh, hit you back with two. Ooh, wow. Okay. Cassius is not messing around. He's not messing around. Okay. 
Uh, that is all for them. Two in the center. Activating those two. Cassius will direct his attacks. There. Auxilio rolls three dice, but they're fighting uphill, so they're going to be capped at two. Uh, both need your support. Okay. Got hit. Leader comes through. Alright. Um, well, they get something back, so two dice. Nothing. Lights will attempt to dislodge those lights from that hilltop. Succeed. And um, I think they're going to advance. Take that hill. Prevent that auxilia from getting up there. That is a good, good plan. So, Auxilia, two dice, nothing. Uh, attacking downhill. Got a leader support. Cassius uh, stoles his men to, to hold that hill. Right. Uh, okay. We will start with, uh, or continue with the slingers here with two dice, hill to hill. Nothing. Two dice back. Mm, Looks like I rolled the same thing you did. I All think right, so. Nothing. All right. Um, this one. Uh, it's going to try a different tack. We go to here, and I'm going to. Press the button at the top this time. See if I get better luck. No, it's the same three times. There's a different way to roll the dice. Well, uh, yes, yeah, so you can do control and the number. That's what I've been oh. typically doing. I, I I always press the button. At the yeah, top. that would explain why you why the dice are always hot. <laughs> I, I've blown my secret. Yeah. All right, bring it back. Uh, two dice fight in the pill. Uh, yeah. Okay. And this one. Now the advance only happens on your when you're right. pressing the right. attack. Right. Right. All right, two dice. Still nothing. Uh, two hits. Okay. Well, that's gonna be that kind of night. Okie dokie. Fantastic. It's yours. Line command. Okay. We'll start over here first. The uh, regular infantry against your infantry on the hill. Two dice. Nothing. Okay, battling back down with two dice. A retreat, which you can ignore. I'm going to take 
that retreat. Okay. All right, we'll do your support infantry. Attacking the same target. Two dice. Nothing. Okay. Uh, two back down. Two hits. Well now. See, the secret's out. <laughs> Hill to hill. Um, still two dice. Meter support. Nothing. Two back. Nothing. Uh, what's going on here? I don't know. All right, well... These guys on the hill okay. are attacking you. Before Two you, dice. Before you do that, uh, I am going to evade. Okay. So. so. Two dice, only counting green circles. Leaders don't count. And that flag doesn't count, but you're still skipping it. All right. That is the extent of my attacks. Ooh, another good card for this game. Mm -hmm. So four lights. Yeah. You got what? Eight. Nine. Nine lights to choose from. So I get four. Um. I will do those four. We'll start with the slingers here. Uh, throwing two dice from afar. Uh, nothing. And then down here. Oh, oh, oh! Would yeah, you like I'll to ignore the okay the banner. All right. Uh, Not nothing. You you you, you bing somebody <laughs> enough to scare them off their hill, but. Uh, well, these Romans are made of stern stuff. So. Yes. Uh, they had entrails for dinner last night. Um, two dice from the other ones. Uh, nothing. Uh, we will do this one to here. And two dice. One hit. And then the auxilia will fight uphill. Same target. Two dice. Nothing. That is all for me. Three in the center. stand. Hmm. One hit, two dice, back. Nothing. Auxilia fighting uphill. Uh, these guys will, Cap e they will evade. Cap two dice for that. Two dice. Cassius fighting downhill. I'll get the roll of maximum of 
gets three dice for his auxilia. With leader support. Ooh. <laughs> Unbelievable. Cassius did not come to play. Or maybe he did come to play. I'm not quite I'm old. I don't I don't get what the kids say these days. Um not gonna advance. We'll do a counterattack. Ah. So three center units of your own. Yes. These three? start with this here. The slingers will draw a bead on the slightly wounded lights on the hill with two dice. With a hit. And these guys will throw their spears up the hill. Two dice. Hit. Throw two hill to hill, getting nothing. Eh, it couldn't last forever. That's the end of my turn. Three units on the left. Those three. So mediums attacking hilltop to hilltop. Okay. Normally they'd be rolling four dice, but uh, this treacherous ground, they'll be capped at three, but they do get some leader support. We will evade that. Okay. That's a good evade. Mm -hmm. Out of target, so that is my turn. Two one more left. Got a unit straddling that line there. These two. Uh, Hasdrubal will move over to the center. Okay. And these guys will throw spears here. Try to finish off the lights. So here comes the spears. Two dice. Uh, nothing. Our retreat. Yes. I'll take it. You'll take it? Okay. That was a good retreat. Uh, that is all. We're gonna press that left flank. These two units. We'll be attacking the slingers. They will evade. Right, so get our full complement of four dice down. But only green circles will count. Pretty much the same effect.
right. Bring this one here. And then... One slingers will throw here. Two dice. And there's... Well, was there anybody else going to move first? No. no. Okay. Um, I'll take that retreat. Okay. Actually, I don't have a choice, so... Slingers will throw at Cassius two dice. Get a hit. All right, leader check two dice. Yes, yes, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> of course. Uh, all right, that's it for me. Back to you. Coordinating an attack. That unit. Those, so those three units. The uh, mediums will battle downhill, capping it at three dice okay. against your slingers. We'll evade. Take a hit. Auxilia fighting hilltop to hilltop. They'll get all three of their dice against your light infantry. Okay. Standing firm? Yeah. Did you move your light slingers? I did. They're the in between Hezdrabal and the and the other one. Okay. Did not move on my screen. Alright, three dice. One hit. Two back. Nothing. Spear at your light infantry. One die. Takes it. Okay. Choose not to do any combat. Really? Really. Well, the, the auxilia can't because they march twice. And the lights choose not to, so. Just sit there. Okay. This will be the time. Play this then. Six dice. Rally a bunch of mediums. So, uh, get one green. All right. So that's just gonna be Cassius's auxilia. So they will attack downhill and target that light infantry. Rolling the maximum of their three dice with a leader bonus. Okay, they'll stand. Mm. Hit and a retreat. Yeah.
be these three. Uh, and we're good with the maneuver. Back to you. Okay. Now order three units in the center, then. Fighting downhill against the light calf. Uh, they will stand. Total of three dice. Two hits. Two hits. Two dice back. Mm, mm -hmm. Nicely done. Auxilia, fighting against your light cavalry, hilltop to hilltop, so three dice. Okay. Hit and a retreat. Hmm. Cat then fighting downhill. Three dice with leader bonus. Gets your auxilia, so no evasions there. Okay, nicely done. Uh, two dice back uphill. Cassius one order his men to stand their ground. Yes, would have been better if that light cavalry had stayed on the hill, but we will, uh... Activate all those. Okay. So, battling uphill, you're capped at two dice. But, with uphill... But you get two. Yeah, two more. You'll get to add two, so each of these units will be rolling four dice in this combat. Right. So we'll start with this. Uh, four dice up at your mediums. A hit and a retreat. And I will happily take that retreat. And retreat to an adjacent hill. Okay. You will advance. Advancing. And battle again with normal dice. Um, same target. We'll do two. Get another one. But you're supported now. I am, and I'll ignore that retreat. Okay. So, let me battle back. So, capped at three, leader support. It was almost worth it. Almost. All right. Um, well, go after Cassius here with four dice. Their last hurrah. One hit. Dice and retaliation. Well, that is all. Glad I can just give you banners. <laughs> Double time. 
four or less units in a block. And then Auxilia with four dice. Leader bonus. Two hits. Okay, three back. Well, ignore the banner. Lights attacking downhill. Two dice with leader support from both sides. Those, those poor bastards. Oh, come forth, Cassius, and bring the end. Uh, you, get, you, get, you get your two dice back uphill. Yeah. There we go. Hey, I hit. Cassius's men, three dice with leader bonus. That is game. Game one is in the books. It is a shutout. Good job. As, uh, I had such a such a hand. I mean, every turn I was getting a card for my center unit. So I, I just I got lucky. Yeah, I. Uh, I still have one. I still have a center unit card that I had drawn two turns ago. I, I was uh, I was never hurting for the cards that I needed. I'm just uh, I I can't hit the broader side of a barn with a die. I am allergic to dice, and they are allergic to me. I had the mount, mounted charge, mm. which I uh, never used. I until you I was going to use that mounted charge to move this unit up here. And then play that rally, but then you moved all those guys there, so I wanted to bolster Cassius's unit, but the well, die roll. I am rolling the one green circle would not have helped. In yeah. This case. Well, I am I am continually impressed at how well you uh, you place your leaders for maximum efficiency. Um, but you know, I I, uh, I would have moved Hasdrubal up, but you can't. I mean, and, and I don't know if it's the the way that the War Council makes you um, overly cautious about losing the camps. I I don't know. I guess perhaps I was. That's why I was waiting for you to come to me on the heavies. Uh, I, well, and with the if the, and if the victory condition was seven banners, I might have felt more compelled to take the camps. But with the victory condition being six banners and six units being on those hills, then getting those abundance of seven, cent uh, seven center cards, right. it, it to me it's just like well I'll just chew them up. Right. Well, once you once you broke through that first one and forced them to flee, and then you just rolled up the two the two flanks. You know, once you got up on the hill and you just started devouring it from the inside outward. I mean, there was just, you know, the slingers aren't going to stand up to, to leader support. So it's like, wow, I could, <laughs> I could really use just, just a little one, you know, something other than a sword hit or a leader symbol that I can't use. Those would be really helpful, but uh, not to get over and over again. But we're gonna, we're gonna reset and uh, we'll see if I can dig myself out of this hole and see how I play the Romans. Uh, can, can, can I be as effective? I hope so. Let's find out. Tides have turned. Yes, well, you said you were stepping away briefly to, oh, what, close the windows? Well, I had to open a window, for I have 
submitted a burnt offering to the gods. Oh, gods, oh, Mars, bring me not cold dice. Bring me forth and let me be an instrument of battle, swiftly mm. and deadly. We'll see if it works. The gods mock me. They mock me. Well, let's All right, let's, let's see what a Roman aggression gets me now. Line command. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're going right up the center. Did I say Roman aggression? <laughs> I, I, I think I meant Roman aggression. Yes. Goodness. All right. Sadly, I only have Cassius in one spot to support, but we will... Uh, you know, feel like he's everywhere. That's true. Um, we'll just start from... Just go left to right. Yeah, the Roman left, two dice, and I will pause if you wish to evade. Um, hmm. I think discretion here will be the better part of the vows. So let's just going to assume I'm going to evade all of these. Okay, fantastic. Attacks. All right. And just uh, quit the hills. Okay, two dice coming up. The high ground. It is a hit. So they're going to evade two. All back there. Okay. Same here. Two dice. Green circles. Nothing. Uh, okay. Same here. Sadly, even with leader support, it matters not. Green circles. Two dice. And two dice. Nothing. Finally, there, combat, two dice, one hit. And these slingers, or lights, will just throw one die at your light. And here we go. Nothing! Alright. That is the Roman opening move. units on the left. Close 30 units. Alright, so... Attack with the light cab first. Okay, we'll stand. Two dice. Uh, we'll ignore the retreat, the retreat and fight back with two. Give you one of your own. And uh, two spears. Thrown from a hilltop. Out of nowhere. I hit nothing but rocks. Three on your left. Gaius Lilia says. I wish to prove myself in battle. So he moves forth. That is all. Two on the Carthaginian left. Carthaginian. Those two. More spears from the hilltops. Oh, nothing. Nope. Guy 
Elias seems awfully motivated. He does. In fact, he wishes to take the lead. Yeah. <clears throat> Look at that. Yes. That's bold. That's someone who thinks they're going to make an advance and attack again. Kind of a move. Perhaps. It's, uh, guys is feeling it. Let's do that. I will be all too happy to thwart Gaius. And simply evade. Mm-hmm. Okay, four dice. One hit. All right. All right. So this is just going to be uh, stand your ground fire, maybe retreat. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh. Those four units. Uh, we'll get started with the light slingers. Oops. The light slingers. So uh, they did not move. They will be rolling two dice. Two dice. Uh, so you did not move. Two dice. Two dice. Wow. You were light troops, I'd be chewing you up. Mm -hmm. And light cab did not move. Two dice. Hey, there's something. Okay. One hit. And a leader check. Two dice. He's okay. Then my move. I have no heavy troops, but I'm depriving you of this card, so I'm happy. Yes, well, I and and I am depriving you of the order medium troops <laughs> card. So there we go. That's right. All right. Just look at that. Drew that blue card right away. I was like, oh, great. Yeah. I've only got four cards, you know. So Gaius Lelius will move forward here and attack the Auxilia. Okay. Uh, okay, nope, that's not what I want. That's what I want. That's what I want. Alright, uh, four dice coming at you with leader bonus. Ooh! That is a decisive attack. Gaius press his luck. Um, yes, he will he'll advance, and he will battle again. And go with four dice there. And so I can't evade, so here it comes. With leader. Uh, one hit. One hit. Two dice in retaliation. 
desperation. Nothing. All right. That is all. Hmm. Five dice. Hmm. Wiped them out. Okay, and a single leader check. He's okay. He falls back to there. More of your heavy troops. Mm -hmm. All right, Laelius will move forward again. Attack these lights. That's we'll better. Evade. They will evade. Okay. Can I evade? Why won't it let me evade? There it goes. Now it's going to let me evade. Alright. So, we have four dice with green circles coming only. One hit. And that is all. Three on the right. Those three units. All right. Moving that. Not moving. Not moving. Okay. Uh, okay. All right. Attacking your mediums. Five dice. Wow. <laughs> uh, man. I believe it was old man Potter who said, Confounded George, are you allergic to success? Yes. Yes, I am. Alright. Uh, leader check, one die. Of course. There you go.
Alright. Cassius is not going to let this Carthaginian impertinence go unanswered. <laughs> this is true. Alright. So, two dice. There. Nothing. Five dice in retaliation. Dice here with leader bonus. Mm, a retreat. Okay. Uh, nobody else has range combat, so I am done. My medium troops on the field. Five dice, only green circles. I'm starting to feel how the Cleveland Browns feel. <laughs> I'm, start, I'm starting. To, I'm starting to understand it. Uh, it's. Uh, it's. It's. This. Uh, it's not good. <laughs> well, that's a, that's a twenty plus year Tampa Bay Buccaneers fan. Oh, I know. I you feel the pain. Mm -hmm. Light troops. Cassius has plenty of those to play with, and they are all at full strength. Okay. Let's see what what kind of damage we can do here. Get the lights versus heavies with leader support. Two dice. And move over here. Two dice. Oops. Two dice coming at you. Okay. I'll ignore the banner. Okay. And uh, two dice in retaliation with your support. A banner. Same target. Two dice. A pill. Not a sausage. Dice back, downhill, leader support. Okay. All right. Double time. Those four units. Right. 
attacking your light infantry from the hilltop. They will stand. Two dice. Nothing. Two back. A retreat. Attacking the same target, this time with your support with light infantry. Two dice. Uh, yes. <laughs> Did you want to evade? No, that's right. Uh, so they will take two. And you certainly could have evaded that. No, that's fine. I wouldn't have because I was gonna. I was hoping to strike another blow. These guys will evade. So attacking downhill, we're gonna cap out at three dice. Hazard ball. Okay. One hit. And they will throw a spite spear at those medium infantry. coming up the hill. Nothing. That's all for me. Those two. Infantry versus light infantry. We'll stand. Two dice with leader support. Hit. Turning fire with two. Same. There is something up with the dice roller, but uh, I've never been able to prove that in 15 years. Oh, I did not do that. Balls directing his heavies to attack the same unit. Okay. So Five I dice. I have at least one space to evade, so I will evade. Good evade. Yes. Center. It's for a last hurrah. Mm. Going after Hasdrubal himself. Yep. Okay. Three dice. The auxilia first. Get a hit. Five dice for retaliation. <laughs> uh, two, three, can't, uh, two hits. Three hits. Yeah. Hit, hit, hit. Okay. Um, one here, same target, two dice. Nothing. Okay, retaliating. them and um, 
Yeah, I'm not gonna, <laughs> I'm not gonna give you that block just yet. I'll let you, I'll let you earn it. Um, there you go. It's yours. Two. Light of entry attacking the auxilia. Two dice of leader support. There you go. Thus ends another sad chapter in my generalship. Uh, man. I've had slumps before, but I don't think I've had them quite this long. I mean, uh, that was, uh, 6065, or 61, rather. So, that's, uh, pretty, pretty, pretty decisive. <laughs> Twelve banners to one. Uh, good work. Thank you. I need to, to rethink apparently everything I know about... Uh, I don't know. I mean, what do you thought? I, I mean, <laughs> every time I think I got something moving, it's not happening. So I need to just... Uh, I need to rewind and, back I mean, to fundamentals. There, there's always the random factor of dice. Oh, and yeah, yeah. When you, you came from your left flank, and I brought those heavies out, those heavies had some great rolls, you know, chewing up some units, and then we got got super lucky and and took out your leader on top of that too with, with a, a missed leader roll. Yeah. So that that's just that's just die rolls of the luck. Yep. Um you know, as far as strategy goes, my plan was kinda of what I did at the, the end here, but not quite as piecemeal, was to kinda of get Hasdrable out in the center form a block of units around those heavies and bring them down. Yeah. Um I just never had the cards to do that. I got I got them I got them out of his camp and then all my cards dried up. Mm. Um my card and that's when you pushed your left and I had a bunch of cards on the right. Yep. So uh, I was able to respond, but you know, it wasn't my plan. Right. Well my cards aren't dry per se but they are kind of uniform it's it's i have currently out of my six cards i have four of them for the center which once the center started to crumble and i moved the leadership out of there i was hard pressed to really do anything helpful i had three on the right which i think i just got previously because i had two on the right and you you see, I started moving Scipio over. So then I got three on the right at the end of that one. And then what'd you do? You moved Hasdrubal just out of range for the next setup. So every time I'm setting up, uh, the next one, you're, you're, you're moving him. And then what did I just draw right before the kill was a double time, which was, you know, if I could have survived one turn, I could get Scipio over there to at least engage with Hasdrubal with at least the two mediums. But even then, it was just so far <laughs> in the hole already that, yeah, once those lights start falling, oh, yeah, yeah, that would have done it. Uh, and and I, I've had that the entire game. Um, had the heavies on my right um, not retreated in every fight they were in, because every, uh, you know, and again, dice. Oh, yeah. You know, oh, yeah. No, no. <laughs> you set yourself up to. to take out those heavies and, you know, surround them and flank them and you put Cassius in the center to get all those leader dice and the first thing you roll is a retreat. Is a retreat. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, that and literally, that's either I'm either I'm getting nothing or I'm getting one shy, which to kill, like up there with the, with the slingers. Um, so it's just, it, yeah, everything hinges on one particular piece of die die work and it's just not it's not happening and i you know i i love i love blaming the dice it's, it's of course it, it's great but it's it's hard when it's disheartening when it's like everything you set up fails on the dice and then every time you're throwing three or four dice it's like oh cross sword green circle green circle leader and the leader i mean that's all on you because you're you're doing an 
amazing job getting the leadership to bear in each of your attacks. So it's like, ah, oh, dizzy, you know, <laughs> how do you, how do you, you can't, you can't compensate for that, you know. So, uh, yeah, no, this, this too shall pass, and, and by the next scenario, I will have forgotten all of <laughs> this, but the video is forever. Oh, man. Wow. Six, zero, six, one. That is just... Whew! Good work. <laughs> I need to. I need a palate cleanser after this, you know. All right. Well, we will move on to the next one. And uh, fantastic job. Good. I mean, the 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 leadership to watch you play the leadership. Um, even when you have just one with Hasdrubal, uh, I, you know, I should be taking notes. But clearly, if I had if if I had the opportunity to move Hasdrubal last time. Uh, well, you saw that I moved him to the center just to keep the options open, but beyond that, I was like, Ugh, what do you what do you do with this guy? And you showed me, so good job. Until we meet again on the field of battle. But uh, next week, I think uh, we're still here. And so as 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 the postscript for this storyline historically goes, um, Scipio did defeat the Carthaginians. He did uh, he drove Hasdrubal from the field, but because the Romans were so uh, focused on looting the camps, he let the legions just take whatever they want, you know, in in the spoils of war. Well, they all focused on the on that, so he was able to get all of his baggage, trains, and elephants, and everything off and away. And they ended up going skirting north through Spain and over the Pyrenees and through the Alps, and then came through and would eventually try to link up with uh, with Hannibal in in Italy proper. So, uh, Scipio caught a lot of merry hell from the Roman Senate for letting him get away, but that's, uh, the dice were not quite in his favor to eliminate them. But, so. All right, until next time. All right, only well, have a good weekend. You too! Have a good one. Bye. See you next time. Yep.